So we all know that we can sell in Instagram by posting reels, stories, or even making some reels. But we always have that question. How long does it take to convert your post into sales? Well, it varies in different several factors. Like for example, it depends on what products or services that you offer. How does your audience engagement, do they engage frequently to your posts, stories, or reels? Do they do comments, likes, or even um, save it? And compelling CTA, like call to action, like swipe up, shop now, contact us, um, learn more which it helps to you know ease the process and guide their customers or audience what is the next step and it also speeds up the conversion rate and that's what we want you can also add up like discounts ad campaigns the timings of when do you post your reels or stories or posts Things like that. It always varies on different factors that sometimes we don't know that it matters. Now let's talk about how do I get sales from from Wizworks. So Wizworks I usually use Instagram as my social media, like my main social media platform to sell my products, especially here in the UAE. And every day, I always have the urge to post at least twice a day or once at night or twice at night. It depends on, as I say, the time of posting. Um, I did a little experiment before, like for example, I tried posting reels in the morning and it didn't really get a lot of engagement like what I I expect but at night or in the afternoon after work after school maybe or people on the road sometimes looking in their phones for reels um, swiping up you know when they're stuck in traffic that's the time that I usually get some sales or conversion or even messages from customers so one good example that I have is my husband Ahmed he usually drive from Dubai to Ajman, like going home, like two to three hours because he's stuck from traffic, especially in um, borders of Sharjah and Dubai. So what happens is he'll be sitting there for 30 minutes or an hour or so, depending, you know, and then he will just keep on scrolling through Reels or TikTok. So I think that that kind of experiment it's also a good idea like you know you're getting an idea that people are tend to more to shop when they are bored they are bored they're scrolling with tiktok instagram you know they just wanted to be happy so i think yeah that's the best time for me 4 p.m to 6 p.m or at night like 8 p.m until 10 p.m so now let's talk about how do i make my videos and instagram reels let's make one so at first i usually scroll first uh, i usually scroll first in instagram what are the current trends right now okay so i will check also the the audio the audio or the music if it is like you know i can do boosting with it or I can make like campaign ads with it. But it has a lot of engagement that I always check. This one is good. I like how does she make it. Oh, it's a he, sorry. So let's see, this one is a good one. So what I will do is I'll save it here. And then I'll try to make a video out of it from CapCat or sometimes um, I will just do download, use this audio, oh, sorry, I will do, oh, there's no option like that, so it's fine, I already shared it, and then I'll try to find another one. So it takes me a while to, Yanni, to find a certain audio or music for my for my videos at the same time i'm trying to already having an idea already what kind of video i wanted to post for today 
it depends sometimes if I have orders like you know day in the life day in my life as a small youtuber or a small business owner I do that or sometimes how do I make my products how do I pack my products or how do I unbox my products those things because as much as possible I wanted to market what products do I have okay this one is good I like this one so it's it has 59,000 uh, reels that has been made with this music probably I'll do one thing share this here to save just in case and then there's a download option here boom I will do that and then I will put it in CapCut It's downloading, okay? And then after that, I will go to my CapCut. And then new project. And then I will insert that video. And probably, I will also extract the audio. Is it still recording? Uh, I extracted already the audio right here. And then I will add some videos onto it. So a while ago, my husband took a video of him de of delivering the products the, to our customer. So probably I'll just try to make a video out of it. Okay. Let's see. You can say like this way, put an overlay. Uh, mm -hmm. Right now really I don't have any idea what to post, but I'm just trying to make some random posts just for the sake of, you know. For the sake of this video okay we're going to cut, cut it there we go add one more here and I'll put it here and then I'll add another video from here I have so many videos, which is good. So I usually stash a lot of videos. So later on, I can use it for reels or, you know, for posting in my stories because it's really good. So later on, you will not having a hard time to find which content or which kind of videos that you wanted to post. Like, for example, this one. Okay, okay. I'll probably use this one instead. Yeah, this one is good. Okay. It's a bit long, but it's fine. Probably I will add the... Which one is it? The box that has a name. Sorry, it takes me a while because I have so many... I want this one. Alright, this will filter it out with nice little touch of uh, what probably or like this way a bit I just say uh let's just say um, what can I say? Uh Weezy works probably I don't know. I okay. Let's just add a point. Adjust the font. There. Probably we don't like with stroke. Yeah, probably something like that. And then let's put some animation. Animation. And then I want to mute everything. And then we're just going to export it. And, and then, of course, I'm going to upload the video that I did here. And then I'll try to make a nice cover here, probably here. Or probably I'll just make it this way to showcase all the products you see 
and then I'll just make a quick caption. Do busy work. <clears throat> Sorry. Do busy work. Products. Thank you so much. And then share. Now let's just try to make a nice um, story. So what I do is I always screenshot the best part of my grid. You, you should always work on your grid. Probably this, this one. I'll screenshot it. And save to photos. And then since I want to share this video, I'll just do it like this to market the new reels that I just put. Do the photos. And then zoom it a bit. And then put drag it down this way. You see it? <clears throat> like you're just going to draw drag it this one to go behind the layer there. So the, the video, my new reels is here. And then I'll just zoom out. And then I'm just going to make it a little bit small. And then put new reels. And done. You have your story. Now let's talk about, okay, stories. In stories, I usually share the products that I have, like what I did a while ago, sharing stories. And then I usually add some link for my website. So they can directly go to that website and check out the products that I have. And it also can lead into another conversion. So lastly, posting or post. It could be posting carousels or just a regular post about your products, you know. So as much as possible, try to be clear on what are you trying to deliver or what, are, what type of service or product that you want to cater your target audience. Like for example, me last time, we did this um, campaign about Ramadan. We did a gratitude planner, uh, a frosted mug glass wherein there is like a Ramadan Kareem, something like that. And also a planner. So that time it's only a post but it we gain a lot of sales from that one because we're trying to market it to the Muslim people like us. A lot of people are trying to make some gifts towards to their families, you know, whenever they they want to visit their family. So yeah, I'll share you one. I'll share you that post. So I will share you those, this post. We did a campaign of Islamic Gratitude Planner and the journal right here. So I'm trying to market two planners that time during Ramadan. And also I did also the Ramadan Daily Planner. So they can do their Salah Tracker, Quran Tracker. So yeah. You just need to make an engaging post that probably can turn into, you know, sales. And also try as much as possible whenever there are people who are posting or commenting on your um, post or even in your stories or even your reels like HM or uh, how much or even salam alaikum, something like that. It means they are interested with your product and they want to learn more what do you offer guys because sometimes people doesn't even know that you have a website especially here in uae so sometimes they usually go directly to whatsapp and try to communicate from you and ask for a catalog or for what are the products that you are offering so as much as possible like i said try to put a link on your stories a website link on your story so that people will always know that you have a website that they can go through and that will also help you that will lead into conversion so yeah good luck with your business and i wish you all the best